this whole deal is you're the teacher. All right. I'm the student. I kind of know how you swing, so I'm going to exaggerate it a little bit, but what I want you to do is you stand back and you watch me, then you got to come up and explain to me, step by step, how to fix it. Okay. Okay? All right. So, my hair first, okay? So I got to get it down. All right, so what did what happened there? Well, I tend to hit everything way to the right, and uh, my misses are right, and then I'll occasionally hit this just real ugly thing that hooks way left. All right, so the way that we're gonna fix this okay. is by first learning what you're doing wrong. Okay. So, um, yeah, go ahead. And when you go up to the top, where's your club? It's across the line, right? It's a little across, yeah. And then when you come down, it's behind you. Okay. And then when you go through the ball and you finish, you go up, right? Okay. So what we're gonna do to fix it is put this line behind you. So we're gonna use these two T's. And what you're gonna do is when you come back, you're gonna make sure the end, butt end of the club of the club is facing that. Okay. And when you swing back, you're gonna release it around this way. Okay. And this is gonna make it so that you don't hit the hooks or the pulls. Okay. Or the the pushes. pull pushes or the hooks. Okay. So that line's behind me, huh? Wait. Should I come close? Yeah. Okay, well, so now if I'm gonna do that now, so you mean I gotta get here and over here? No, you have to. It's <laughs> okay. okay, you're the teacher. Okay. This is why you got the Oh, you got I got the. Spot. That's okay, you're very close. But see, here's what happens. Oh, this it's is... in front, right? No. no, okay, so here becomes, no, no, this is great because you're gonna be on film getting this now. <laughs> Oh God, <laughs> sorry guys. <laughs> so you analyze the swing right. So okay. I get the club, my shoulders get a little flat so it gets around me across the line. So that makes me come underneath, which misses right or left, perfect. We gotta get the club so that it comes around me more and doesn't go out to the right so much. Right. Perfect. When you put this stick down <laughs> though, when I set up to the ball, that stick should be right under Oh. the handle of the club. So this T would be right there, and that T would be right there. Okay. You thought that this T was supposed to be behind me. That's too far behind me, so right. I can't get there. So where that T should be is when you drop a ball, and then I'm gonna let you do it again. Okay. All right, so now when I set up, if I took a ball and I dropped it right from the handle of that club, it would fall on that stick. Ah, uh, okay. That line is a parallel line to the target line. So now well, my club won't hit you. So okay. now my club has to go right over that spot. Okay. Then it has to come back down there. And then it works out, it pivots and it works out in front of me. Then it pivots around here and it hits that T there. Okay. Okay, it's your turn again. So. I just Wait, so why did you, whenever you put it, you put it on me. Yeah. You put it right there, right? You put yeah. the T's right there. I put the T's here and here just because it's all a function. Okay, where you put the T's. So if somebody stood away from the ball like this. Uh, then you can put it there. You'd put, this would be a line. Got it. So you'd put a line right under the this. Okay. The T would be right there. I see there what there. you're saying. If somebody stood like this. You this, put it here. You'd have to put it there. Okay. Okay. That makes sense. Because okay. The handle of the club through this area has to work on a line that's that's parallel to the target line. Okay. Okay? Yes. Okay. Okay. So so now we got it right. So now you're gonna come so go ahead now and come in and fix me. Okay. So now the way that we're gonna fix you is by putting so to put your um, stands and we're gonna take where the handle comes down, we're gonna make an imaginary line 
Perfect. Two would be right there. And we're gonna put two T's. All right. And now I want you to swing back. Exactly, and point the end, butt end of the club to that okay. T. And then whenever you swing forward, exactly, make the weight of the club, uh, make the your hands go left towards that other T. Okay, all right. Now let me do it slow and see if I'm right. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Uh oh. <laughs> so that's it. That's all I want you to do. <laughs> See, if you keep See, doing that, that then you, you keep taking people out of well, the tournament. Okay. And now then why, no more. Let me ask you something though. <laughs> why? That feels to me like my club is, even though it's coming, it's coming over my hands and it's coming from in here. It feels so much around. Why does it round over here? Why doesn't the club, that feels like I'm gonna pull it more. Now why, if I make the club go around here, why doesn't it go out away from me? Because you're trying to swing on a circle. <laughs> <laughs> there aren't any straight lines. Okay, so the minute the club runs into the ball, it comes in and it runs into the ball coming slightly from the inside of the target line. Then the minute it hits the ball, the handle and the club head are going around to the left. At no point in time do you hit the ball and the handle and the club head go down the target line. Exactly, and that's what you were doing in your first swings. So we're not gonna try to do that anymore? Nope. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, that was awesome.